Hey guys, this is Captain Cale with Migrator Fishing Charters. We're out here, it's about 5.15 a.m. We're just getting set up. We're gonna show you guys how to set an SWR downrigger rod here. We're running the Moonshine Magnum RV Shelly Snack. Um, it's a great multi-species spoon, caught a really big trout yesterday and a couple of cohos down deep. An SWR is lead core on a downrigger. So you can run a one color, two color, three color, even four color. I know guys have run up to six, seven colors, but usually two or three colors. Is the, is the standard amount of line let out on an SWR. This one's got a little extra, a little over three colors on it, just because that's what we had left on a spool. Whatever you put the, uh, the spoon down to on the rigger, so if you put it down 50 foot, you're really gonna be fishing you know, 60 to 65 feet down. One of the really effective things about an SWR is, is that you're getting really far away from the boat, so it really adds a, a, a stealth factor to the presence. Um, we like to use the Scotty pinch, pinch release. Doesn't damage the line, it's really safe on it. 15 pound weight for deep water fishing. And the biggest thing when setting a deep rigger is don't open up the bail. Let the drag do your work for you. It'll keep a really nice bend on the rod. I like keeping a really strong bend on the rod. That way, when a fish hits it and you grab it, you're not reeling in all that slack. It pops off the rigger and you're there right away. So I'm gonna put this down about 70 feet to start, just cause it's gonna be one of my deeper rods this morning, looking for kings, lake trout, maybe a deep coho, and that's it. And then just a little extra slack out of the line and you're good to go.